Liam, a night of frustration. What's your immediate thoughts after the game? It's hard really um, to bring words to it. Uh, just not good enough all through the board. Um, we sat in there for a while after the game and reflected on some stuff and um, spoke to the gaffer and the, team, the boys and stuff. And look, we've got so much to play for and um, the rest of the season and semi final and stuff. We need to stick together and get through this wee rough patch we're in. The manager said he'd like to see us from this point onwards just going back to basics. Would you agree? Yeah, I think I think we need to we need to get that spark spark back that we had um, a few weeks back um, and, and really build on it. And like we're all we said that in the dressing room, like we're no turning bad players overnight, um, and we need to get back believing each other and, and trusting each other and, and get back to the way that we, we did it the kind of through the season. What do you think has has been the, the cause of this little slump at the moment? Honestly, mate, I, if I knew the answers, I'd tell you, and it's it's hard uh, to kind of give words to you to now after that performance tonight. Half time, could we have been ahead? Potentially, yeah. I think we had a couple of chances, maybe not clear cut chances, but we did have chances, and kind of been the story of our season through some of the, the the lower teams in the league not taking our chances, and it gives them a little bit of belief and um, gives them something to hold on to, and, and you've seen that tonight. The goal, the first goal, perhaps slightly fortuitous for FC Edinburgh. They, they took it well, but the deflection couldn't have made it fall any nicer, could it? I know it's it's one of those nights, one of these uh, balls break and they get little ricochets, and it, it's, it's it's worked for them tonight, and obviously not for us. And it's hard, to, I don't know what to say really. It seemed to kind of <clears throat> jolt us a little bit, and the subs gave us a little bit of fresh impetus. Of course, we seem to be back on a, a level keel when uh, when Kai popped one in the net. Yeah, the look. Kai, Kai coming inside like that, he's got a really good shot and um, you've seen it against Air as well and against Airdrie here and the, the volley he scored so no he's got he's got really good ability and he, he's maybe never done it enough tonight but he's, he showed like he's got just so good and um, we need that more from him like that. And at that point you're thinking well there's a chance there to now go on and, and win the game? I think so, I, I think there's still what, maybe 10 minutes left was it? So when, when we scored that, I think we were pushing quite a lot to try and get that equaliser. And when we scored that, I was like, right, here we go, Like we've got another chance. Like Airdrie on Saturday, we, when we got the equaliser, I thought maybe we can go and sneak one. And I don't know, like, I don't know, I can't remember exactly what happened with the goal and it just kills us, it just kills us. It's just a, a counter-attack, but I guess fair play to Edinburgh. They've, they've not had too many opportunities, but they've, they've taken a couple. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Painful one, I know, and it's yeah, always difficult after after a defeat. Safe to say, I mean, the manager had the guys locked in for for about three quarters of an hour after the game. Um, without going into too much detail, not a happy boy. No, and rightly so, and and we can all apologise to the fans as well for that. Um, we 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 chatted over the game and chatted over things that we need to work on and improve and get back to like what I said at the start of the, the, the conversation we were having, like back to that spark that we that we that we do have, and we just need to get that back and. Like we've got so much to play for and we need the fans to be behind our back for the, the remainder of the season and um, yeah. And just finally it's Aloha away on Saturday. What are we going to have to do differently to get a reaction? We're going to have to have a lot of spirit and heart and, and like I said get that spark back and get back to winning ways. Liam, always difficult after a defeat we know but I appreciate the honesty. Thank and you. That's your time. Cheers mate, thanks.